So EA dropped the 87 plus mixed campaign upgrade. Let's open up a bunch of these and hopefully get some decent cards. If you guys are looking for cheap, fast and reliable ultimate team coins, check out MMOEXP.com. Link in the description, save 5% using code HABER. We also got a loading screen for Winter Wildcard, which is coming out on Friday. And I just want to say the one section of EA that does not get enough praise is the design section because their designs are just amazing. So 87 plus mixed campaign pick. One Trailblazer Centurion or Triple Threat. It's an 86 and an 84 rated squad. Here we go. Let me know what you get in your comments down below. Sorry, look, what you get in the comments down below is what I meant to say. Wait, who have I just got? Hang on. Pedri. Uh, that's not bad at all. Pedri's not bad at all. For some reason, I'm not even joking. I thought I just got like Putellas or something. I thought I got like, uh, or like Bon Matty or someone like that. That's not bad though. Pedro to have like 130 odd K. I mean, I'll happily take that. It was quite an expensive SBC, but that's a decent card. I thought that was Bon Matty, to be fair, but I'll still take it. Yeah, that's that's solid. That's solid. We also got a couple of new store packs. We got ourselves a premium dynasties pack, guarantees of one dynasty player, and also a deluxe team of the group stage pack, guarantees one team of the group stage. So we'll open up this one first. We get ourselves a Europa League team of the group stage. Who is going to be a Hubendish and who's going to be behind him? It can't be amazing, I don't think. The Europa League ones aren't fantastic. We've got Boniface, who's meh. I don't really care. Um, oh, Inform Mallard, though. I'll happily take that. That's solid. All right. Now for uh, two premium dynasty packs. I feel like these are a little bit late. We'll open it anyway. Wait, I got a UCL hero? Oh, the dynasty's terrible. Dynasty's awful is Voron, but we've got Dudek as well. Okay, I don't really care about that. We've got Doc, Doc Ock, Dudek. Eh. I mean, the fodder's all right. Voron, Fabinho, nothing really exciting in the dupes. I don't mind discarding all this, though. We'll get rid of all that. Voron's very, very bad. Just give me Rasmus Hoyland, EA. One more chance at an untradeable Rasmus. Come on. Who are we getting, EA? Spanish, CDM. So it's Rodri. And we have a Dangler. The one good, hopefully. Maybe maybe a Jiggy Harlan or something. Who is it going to be? Who is that? Uh, it's Brat Bruns. That is terrible. I would personally stay away from all three of these store packs. Both the Dynasties and the Team of the Group Stage one as well. Just a complete waste of money, in my opinion. In terms of price in these packs as well, some of the best cards we've got. Kin and Bappe. Caroline Graham Hansen, Marcus Rashford, Hyung Min Son, Salah De Bruyne. Then the highest triple threat is Karchawi. We've got Cascarino in there as well. Uh, Ronaldo's Trailblazer. It's actually a lot cheaper than I thought it would be. Uh, Jaman Muziala, Gioro. Uh, and then my Pedri's down here as well. So there's some decent cards in there. We're going to go ahead and open up Lala's pack next and see what we get for Lala. Fingers crossed it's something good. I think these are a little bit more expensive because of the rating minimum. But actually, like... There's some decent cards packable there. English striker. Harry Kane? I mean, it's not terrible. 92 rated Harry Kane. At least it's decent fodder. I did not see Harry Kane when scrolling through there, though. So I don't think he's among the most expensive options overall. But 92 rated is decent fodder. The only annoying thing is he does have an SPC out. That's a little bit better than this card now. Not terrible, though. All right, we've got Dario's pack next. Come on. Oh, hello. I have to deal with moving forward. Cal Hanoglu, welcome to the club. Hopefully, you're going to bring the luck. Fingers crossed. Come on. This is it. We have another Centurions. England. Oh, my God. I thought it was Rashford for a sec. Wait, who's on an English Arsenal CB? Is it Bright? Williamson, sorry. Not, not a bad-looking card. I'm not going to lie to you. I saw England and my heart sank. I thought it was Rashford. That's not a bad looking card at all, though. I'm surprised she's actually that cheap. I guess she's probably like, what? Yeah, 5'7". That makes a lot more sense, actually. That's not a bad looking card, though. Oh, man. I really thought that was Rashford for like a brief second. So apparently there's actually only six players in this pack that are actually worth less than the pack itself. Ronaldo? Ruben Diaz? That's not bad. Apparently, yeah, there's only six players in total that are worth less than the pack itself, which is really surprising. Um, the SPC is worth about 100k. So you break even with Ruben Diaz, and then you've got the actual only ones that are worth less are 
Ashley Neville, Riyad Mahrez, Kevin Trapp, Leah Williams, and Thiago Pop and Kane. That's actually seven. But one of them might be an SBC, so I might mess that up. Um, wow. Actually, not a bad value pack at all. Yeah, so with that information, this pack is actually a really, really good value SBC. So we're going to open up the next one and see what we get. Come on. Oh, we have items to deal with first. We have items to deal with for Reuven. Hegering, welcome to the club. You're going to bring us the luck, all right? She is going to bring the luck. Come on. Here we go. Bash. Let's get another good card. It is going to be a trailblazer. England. Strike is another Harry Kane. So, upon realizing that there's only six players worth less than the pack, we've actually packed like three of them so far, which is quite funny. Uh, not surprised. EA are very stingy. So, you know, buckle up. All right, we go again. Come on, we just want to break even or better. Don't be England. USA. Riker. Who's this? USA stock. Oh, that's good, right? Yeah, Smith. That's good. I feel like that's very good, actually. How much is Smith worth? I have the list on my other monitor now, so I'm just looking through it. I feel that's very good. Wait, where is she? She's not even on the list. Oh, there she is. Oh, she's actually very high on the list. She's higher than a lot of the cards on there. A lot of good cards. She's like 260k. That is a really good pull. I mean, the stats alone look very nice. Four-star skills, five-star weak foot. You can play at right wing as well if you needed to. That's a good card, man. That's a very good card. You take that. That's probably our best one so far. So Smith is definitely like the best one so far. We go again to the next one. I just want to see players high on this list. Here we go. Brazil. Centre-back Marquinhos. About the same sort of uh, area on the list, actually. He's worth about 255k. Another W, though. This actually might be one of the... Uh, voice crack. Might be one of the best value SBCs I've ever released. Well, not ever, but like in a long time. This is great. We'll take that, though. Marquinhos is another big W. All right, next up with a with another 87 plus mixed campaign bag, as I like to call it, the best value SPC on FC24. We have got ourselves another Centurion, Spanish centre mid, B Bon Matty this time, please. B Bon Matty this time. It's Pedri again. I mean, we'll take Pedri. Pedri's not bad. Bon Matty would have been a lot better. It is Bon Matty, right? I'm not. I'm not mistaken. That it is Bon Matty. Yes, he's about about. Two and a half times the price, roughly. It would have been a lot nicer, but it's fine. It's okay. All right. We have another 87 plus mixed campaign. Come on. Another Centurion. French. Is that Gyoro? That's Gyoro. Very nice. What's Gyoro worth? Where is she in the rankings? Worth about 170k. We'll take it. We'll take it. She's very she's very good, actually. I've got her on my account. She's actually a really solid card. She's like a little mini Kante, really. Um... That's solid. That is another really, really nice card. You take that. I like that playstyle plus as well. The, like, relentless one. Just on, on any midfielder, like, their stamina is noticeably just perfect throughout the entire game. This account might be red-listed. This account very much might be red-listed. We're about to find out. Centurion. England, left wing. It's, a, it's, it's sadly an L. It's, like, one of, the, one of the six only Ls, unfortunately. But my chat swears that this card is great in-game. So, like... I'm not going to judge straight away. Yes, it's price-wise, it's it's very it's bad. She's worth about a third of the actual SBC. But my chat swears by her in game. So, you know, take that. Take that how you will. And that kit is actually really cool as well. Mo is ripping open the elite team of the group stage pack. So, you know, we're uh, we're mixing things up and we're going to check this out. We do get ourselves a hero. So, it's going to be Boniface's Europa League team of the group stage and John Onorisa. John Onoris is all right, but, like, he's not super exciting, really. Inform Mallard there. Inform Gyari. Uh, Modric, Rolfo. The fodder's not as good as I was hoping. A bit more fodder there, actually. But for sort of £25, not sure the value is there, really. All right, Alex has sent in his uh, pack via a clip. Let's see who he gets. England, centre mid. Has he got Jude? All right, that's pretty good, to be fair. That is pretty good. Jude Bellingham is fantastic, in fairness. He's very high on the list as well. How much is Jude Bellingham? Uh, Jude is about 440k, so that is class. All right, 584 plus for Tunkamon now. Hello. Hero. We got ourselves John Onorisa. Wait, hang on. No, we don't. We got Reeton. And who is going to be the hero now? Got to be Tevez, I dare you. Be Tevez. Who's that? 
Is that Viale? Guli, Julie. That's okay. Right? I actually don't know if he's expensive or not. The card looks okay. The only thing is with this card is that his like normal hero got, got given out so much. I think people have probably already used this card a lot. But he's worth like 100k, so you'll take it. That's solid. All right, we've got Charlie's 87 plus mixed campaign pack next. Who is he getting in this? It's going to be Spanish. Sense mid. Go on, Bon Matty this time. Please. Yes, it's Bon Matty. Let's go. I can tell by the playstyle plus. That's class. Bon Matty is worth about 400 and something K. Can you take that? These have been really good, man. These have been really good in my opinion. Bon Matty is a class pool. Four star skills, five star weak foot. I've heard is one of the, one of the best center mids on the game as well. So you absolutely love to see it. Perfect link as well with Putellas. So you cannot go wrong. Women's Ballon d'Or winner right there. All right, Samson sent in his pool. Oh, no way. He got Graham Hansen. No way. Oh, that is huge. Graham Hansen, 1.1 million. That is huge. Imagine her perfect, not perfect link, but strong link with uh, that Bon Matty pull as well. That is class. GG. All right. Last 87 plus of the video, we're going to end it off with a cheeky trailblazer, Portuguese centre-back, Ruben Dish. If you guys have enjoyed, make sure to leave a like down below. Subscribe if you guys are new around here. And I'll see you lads later.